farming really fast? Did you fall down? All of us individually, we have a special place in our heart for dance. But when you bring that passion together as a team, it takes it to a whole different level. Um, we really feel like we're on a high. Um, like I said, since we are a family, it's, it's a good feeling um, to not just have love for each other as people, but love for each other as artists and athletes. There's definitely a lot of pride in representing the University of Hawaii. I and mean, being able to do that with a talent that so many of my dancers have been raised to do. Um, a lot of my dancers have been dancing since they were four, if not earlier than that, four years old and earlier. So it's nice to see them being able to do this and support their school in this way, and really support the state in this way. My name is Janelle Sinke. I'm the head coach for the University of Hawaii Rainbow Warrior Dance Team. I myself was a rainbow dancer back in my undergraduate um, studies, and now I'm the head coach, and this team is one that is completely diverse. I've been really blessed with a team that's supportive and collaborative, so it's making my first year as head coach something that's fun, and it's a, it's a new challenge every day, but it's one that we're overcoming as a team. Um, I have a great support system in my assistant coach and my captains. I have three captains this year. Um, so with the Rainbow Dancers, I am the captain this year on the team. So I actually did um, the dance team when I was a freshman. I kind of always knew, I guess like in high school, you know, growing up in Hawaii, you see the dance team at like the football games and basketball games. So I kind of always knew that I wanted to do the dance team. Um, so I auditioned and when I was a senior in high school, um, made it on the team. I did team for four years in my undergraduate. Um, I decided to take a break because I was going to go into my master's and I didn't know how school was going to be. So did one year off the team but I really missed it so decided to do team again this year. And it's been really great. I think it helped to shape my college years. I have made some of my best friends on the team. Um, I've gotten to travel with the team. We've, we go to the um, Big West tournament in the spring to support the basketball team. So that's always really fun. You get really close with your dance teammate. We're a little bit different from like a typical like mainland dance team because down here in Hawaii we like to incorporate different styles. When you're new and you're trying out for a team, you just want to get as much information and advice as you can. So um, just yeah, reaching out to us and then making sure that um, you have those solid bases and different dance styles. I've only actually been on the dance team for since the beginning of the school year, I just started this year actually. Just because it was my last year, so I wanted to make sure that I get the best, you know, the best of it before I graduate. At first, I was really overwhelmed. I was like, oh my god, I'm the only guy on this team. Or, I'm the only other guy on this team. And, oh my god, we're going to stick out and it's going to feel so weird. But, you know, after you danced so much in um, many performances, you just get used to it. It almost doesn't even matter. My experience as a freshman on the dance team has actually been really nice. Everyone's very welcoming. Um, my background, I've been dancing since I was three, so just getting into the college, I was like, I wanted to keep dancing even if it wasn't um, professionally. And I wasn't going to audition at first because I wasn't able to make it for the live audition but last minute I decided to do the video audition. So I'm glad I did that. Um, I came on the dance team my first year of college and it was actually a funny story because I came on peeping through the window of rehearsals. I really wanted to get on team and I didn't even know that they had a team out here. So I would peep on their practices so I could see what they're doing and know what to train on. And the coach actually saw me peeping through the window. So he walked out and asked if I needed help. I told him I was interested and just long story short, he let me do a mid-season audition and now I'm here on the team as co-captain. So it's been a journey, but it's definitely been worth it. A really cool thing is, unfortunately last year, like I had to leave for medical leave when I got really ill. And I had a video sent to me from my team doing a dance number um, and they posted it on social media and they gave me a shout out and said that they loved me and supported me. And that's really what reminded me that this team is really about about family and supporting each other when we are in our lows. It's not just about being talented, but it's about spreading that love with one another.